thing I'm going to introduce, and there's three things. The first thing is going to be what's called the class yes. Have you guys done class yes? No. No. Awesome. Here's how it works. A lot of fun. Need the energy. Here we go. First of all, when I say class, you say yes. Seems simple, right? Let's try it. Class? Yes. yes. Awesome. Now, here's the deal. The fun part is, however I say class, you have to say yes. So, for example, if I say class, you say? Yes. I like it. I like it. If I say like a... Uh, Class, any class, you say? <laughs> Perfect. So, here's what I want you to do. I want you guys, Tyler, to go ahead, and I want you to have a small conversation for about 10 seconds. I want you just to talk with the person next to you about what you did at recess or for the vacation. Talk about it, and then, time out, and then, when I say class, you say yes, and bring all your eyes back up front and don't talk. That's the trick. When I say class, you say yes, and then you stop talking. So, at this time, talk to the person around you about 10 seconds. Go ahead. <laughs> second half of the year. Here we go. Rule number one, and feel free to do gestures while I'm doing gestures because you're going to have to do them in a second, but here we go. Rule one is to follow directions quickly. Go ahead like this. Go like this. Rule one, follow directions quickly. Here's what I need you to do. When I say rule one, you tell me what rule one is and you do the gesture for rule one. We keep the energy high. Here we go. Rule one is to follow directions quickly. Ready? Rule one. Follow directions quickly. Beautiful. Now, rule two, you can do gestures, here we go. Rule two is going to be raise your hand for permission to speak. Once again, rule two is raise your hand for permission to speak. Come on, Alma, you can do it, here we go. You can go. Okay, now when I say rule two, you tell me what rule two is, and then you do the gesture. What is rule two? Raise your hand for permission to speak. Good, now let's do rules one and two, quick review. Once again, do it with me, here we go. Rule one, follow the quickly. Rule two, raise your hand to speak. Excellent. Here we go. Rule three, very similar. Rule three is raise your hand for permission to get out of your seat. Once again, rule three, raise your hand for permission to get out of your seat. Great job, Tim. Okay. Once again, when I say rule three, tell me what it is and do the gesture, Tyler. Here we go. Everybody. Rule three is? Raise your hand for permission to get out of your seat. Fantastic. Let's do all three together at the same time. Here we go. Rule one. Follow directions quickly. Rule two. Raise your hand for permission to speak. Rule three. Raise your hand for permission to speak. Awesome. Here we go. We got two more. That's it. Five rules. That's it. Rule four. Rule four. Is going to be make smart decisions. Here we go. Rule four, make, make smart decisions. When I ask you what rule four is, tell me what rule four is, and then tell me with the gestures, please. What is rule four? Fantastic. Let's review them all again. Here we go, Josh Long. Here we go. All four rules, all together. Here we go. Rule one, follow directions quickly. Rule two, raise your hand for permission to speak. Rule three, raise your hand for permission to speak. Four, make smart Great job, Tyler. Here we go. Last one. Last one. You guys might think it's a little bit corny, but I'll tell you right now, this is the most important rule. Because if you can do this, Demetrius, if you can do this, your days are going to be much more happier. So here we go. Rule five is to make your dear teacher happy. Once again, rule five, Mr. Mollick, is to make your dear teacher happy. Once again, let's gesture. Rule five is to make your dear teacher happy. When I ask you what rule five is, tell me what rule five is using the gestures. What is rule five? Make your teacher happy. Let's do them all together one time, all five, using gestures as a class. Lots of energy. Here we go. Rule one, follow directions quickly. Rule two, raise your hand. Good. <laughs> 
Now, last thing, third part, the funnest part of all, in my opinion. Here we go, it's called the Teach OK. What happens is this. You're going to teach the person sitting next to you. So basically, you can figure it out who's next to you at your table. You will teach that person. Now, here's how it works. You're going to be teaching each other the five rules. Here's how the Teach OK works. When I say teach, you say OK, then you turn to your partner and you teach them. Let's just practice the teach okay part. Don't talk to your partner, but when I say teach, you say okay, ready? Teach. Okay. Now, once again, how I say teach, you have to say okay. Let's try this, ready? Teach. Okay. okay. Not bad, not bad, let's try this. Here we go, how about uh, teach? Okay. okay. That's okay, one more try, because I still got some off things here. Try one more time, let's do a little bit of difficult one, let's try. Teach. Okay. Yes. Okay. Here's how it's going to work. I'm the teacher. Class? Yes. Good. Here's how it's going to work. When I say class this time, when I say class this time, you're going to say teach, you're going to turn to your partner, and you're going to teach them the five class rules. You're going to use gestures, and you're going to be talking at the same time. You're going to keep repeating those five class rules until I say class and bring you back. So for example, he'll be looking at Michael going, okay, rule one is going to be boom, rule two, rule three. And Michael at the same time is looking at him going, rule one, rule two. And they're going to just go back and forth. So you're talking at the same time to each other using gestures, high energy, and you're talking about the five class rules. Are we ready? Uh, are we ready? Yes! Okay, here we go. Oh. Teach. Okay. Go, teach him. Let's go. Five class rules. 